TGIF, everybody. It is Friday, January 18th, 2019. It is Jen in the shop and uh, giving you these tasty little pieces of eye candy to look at this morning. It, it's early. There's coffee. There's always new stuff. I've been cleaning shop, so I'm a little sneezy, a little stuffed up, um, but just kind of getting everything clean so I can get into big production this weekend. Here's what we've got. We'll start off with this little piece because it's right here up front. This is the Gilly Gilly. All of this stuff is available at www.jekylbaits.com. But you already know that. Haven't shown one of these in a while. The Gilly Gilly. Um, obviously, I have a, a pro staff for Greg Gilly. So it sort of kind of became a joke with Gilly Gilly like Dilly Dilly. So just, you know, random chatter at this point in the morning. But this is a really cool pattern because it kind of, it kind of, blends colors in the background and then puts that orange that signature pumpkin seed look in the front of the bait a little bit of blue there's a maui blue on top and that little 3d we, we i, I kind of call it feathering the paint back on the patterns we've got a hamilton craw um another one that these seem to be real popular there's a little glitter on this for the customer this morning um, I, I think it was Mitch on uh, on my Facebook page uh, called it Barney, which is awesome. I, I hey, it's purple and green, so Barney works for me. Uh, somebody else was calling it the Incredible Hulk. So this this is one of my favorite. I, I love the color combinations. It's very very uh, Nolens, very Louisiana because of the purple and green. Just needs that little bit of gold going on in there, and it'd be perfect. But this is the Hamilton Crawl, just another version of it. This is kind of cool. I'm trying to figure out if I, and there's a, just a little bit of, I've been kind of chipping the, working the, the eyelets here, getting those cleaned up because these are all going to be going out this morning. But I'm really digging these new eyes. I got, um, got a card of about 350 of these uh, iridescent red eyes. And I think these would be smoking hot for like rodents and, and mice and things of that nature and any kind of little tiny mammal that you guys want to replicate. Um, so yeah, just really good little eyes here and I like it on against this gray and black. It's a reverse shad pattern on a 1.5 DD. We've got the Oki Max. There we go. We're jamming this morning, y'all. Come on, jam with me. Get up, move around, get that blood flowing. It's Friday morning. Hopefully you guys will get a little fishing time in this weekend if you're not covered in snow. I think uh, every time I've I've seen my, my family and, and people post from back home, it's D.C. and uh, Maryland and Pennsylvania is all covered in snow. So y'all be careful. Go play. Go make some snowmen. Do some ice fishing. But watch that ice. Make sure it's four inches thick or it'll kill you quick. Another Night King. Loving these Night Kings. And no two are the same because they're all uniquely created. That's the, one of the beauties about being an artist and not an imager is that uh, you always get to play with the patterns and, and do something completely unique for your customers. So this has got a little bit of darker blue on top and it's I kind of did uh, this little, uh, it's sort of like the Maui blue that was on the other one to match the Azer eyes. And whoo, those eyes, those eyes, you all know where that came from. John over Jetson. We have, uh, speaking of those eyes, we have the American Bullfrog. I haven't done one of these in a while. But this is uh, this is one order that's going to be headed out to a customer this morning if I can get it knocked out in time before my carrier arrives. Do have a couple of packages going out. And then an abalone, another red-eyed wonder. But I just, I really like these new eyes. I got them in red. I got them in blue, too. It's like an iridescent. You guys have probably all seen the other iridescents that are out that Dinger has. Um, just super happy. Look at, look at these eyes, y'all. That's so cool. So cool. I know you guys are going to ask me where I got them. I'm not sure I'm ready to give that up just yet. Girls got to keep some secrets. This is the natural thread, thread fin, if I can get that out in one sentence. I know I'm kind of racing through this, but uh, it's, it's going to be a big day. I've got a lot left to do and a couple of big orders to tackle once I get off of the get off the channel with you guys. We're going to be doing another spray session this weekend. I still have the Big Bass to paint. It has not been painted yet. I haven't made a video of it yet. So um, 
Radio Garden. That's where we're at this morning. And where are we listening to? San Francisco, California. We're listening to Bagel Radio. I don't even know what that means. Um, it's a breakfast station, perhaps. Who knows? But there's your natural thread fin. And I think that, that uh, that's the... Oh, no, you know what? I've got a couple more. So you guys are... Thank you, thank you, thank you. I got a lot of compliments on this one. This is a lot of hand detailing, um, but it's a lot of fun. I, I had a blast. I've made two of these. One of them is sold. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be selling this one straight out. I've got um, orders for them, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a, a few more, at, and who knows. And then, I wasn't sure if I was gonna show this to you guys or not, um, this is one of two pieces that I'm putting together for Johnston Lures. So Johnston Lures has a contest every year. It's a painting contest and I normally don't really get hyped or, you know, it's, I love contests and I, and I think they're, it's a great way to, to venue your work. And, um, it's just lots of fun seeing how people interpret different patterns and what they're going to do. This I'm just having fun with, and it's really, I'm, I'm showing you this this morning, you guys, because look at the cool lures that these guys at Johnston put out. Um, this is the perch pattern. This is a perch lure. Obviously, it's a big one. Um, I did it in a brook trout. The, um, oh my God, you guys, I had to change the station, turn the music down or something. I was, it was just too much for me this morning. Um, but yeah, this is, this is the, uh, the brook trout. And the, the really awesome thing about this is it, it's given me a chance to throw some patterns on lure blanks that I have not used. Johnson Johnston produces two lures. This one, uh, which is their perch pattern. And then they produce... Let's see if I can get this out here. This is their toothache. And these are these are big game fish lures. Uh, it's, a, it's just a lot of fun to put something on a bigger pattern. So this is what I picked out for one, and then I'm gonna do something that I'm I don't know. I might not tell you guys. I might. I already have ideas for what I'm gonna do with this. Um, but it's just fun to do it on. So Johnston uh, and Kyle specifically, thank you so much for uh, getting me involved in this contest. It is a pleasure, and I can't wait to see what people are doing and uh, the, the cool work that gets submitted. So you can see their, the work and the contest stuff on Instagram. You can see it on uh, Facebook, Johnston Lures. And, uh, hey, go get some lures and, and enter the contest. I think you have until February 28th to submit. All the rules and regulations are online at thejohnstonlurecompany.com. So um, that's going to do it for today, folks. I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. Please be safe if you're ice fishing. Please be safe if you're out in general because the, the roads are going to be bad on the East Coast and Midwest, I think, as well. Um, we're supposed to get ice here. So fun, fun, fun. January, you guys. We'll see you later. You guys have a good one.